Hi, I'm Christopher Marland, Snowflake Solutions Architect here at Aimpoint Digital and also a Snowflake Data Superhero. Now in this third video of our Cortex LLM function series, we're going to be looking at the summarize function. Now, if you have any freefall text data, it's quite probable that a lot of that data is very, very wordy. And it's probably quite daunting, the idea of you manually having to go through and read all that data to extract information. Luckily for you, Snowflake has made that redundant. And now what you can do is you can use the summarize function in a select statement to extract all of the key information in a nice digestible way for you to be able to analyze. So if that sounds helpful, stick around and we'll get using. So in this video on the summarize function, this is much simpler than the previous two functions we've been looking at in this series. So, it's actually quite a short video where I'll just show you basically how to how to use it. Um, if you've not been watching previous videos, then I just want to draw your attention to this section. You do want to uh, upload uh, movies.park. You should see the link to that below. Um, you want to upload that and just run this code here, which will create that table. Um, as always, I do think it is a good idea to start by looking at uh, our data. So let's just uh, select star. Um, what we can see is these are the top 10 uh, grossing films of all time, just a lot of data about them, you know, who did the music, uh, when was it released, running time, all that stuff. And we finish with the plots. As you can see, the plots are big. Um, so you may actually just want to see a very condensed version of that. So what we're going to do is select, I would probably want the title so we have an idea of what's going on there, put the plot, see what we're actually looking at, and then we want to use the summarize function. Now, um, the summarize functions, they, uh, well, the summarize function is a cortex function, as as indicated by the title of this video. Um, with the cortex functions, they're all quite like UDFs, so they belong within a database and within a schema. So a little bit different from the way you may call other things. So snowflake.cortex.summarize, um, and you know, it's the American spelling, uh, either unfortunately or uh, gladly, depending on your perspective there. Um, but all it takes is just the one parameter, the thing you want to summarize. That is all. So I'm just aliasing that as plot summary, and I'll run this. And hey presto. Um, so it's all looking fairly similar, but let's have a see here. So um, I have watched Star Wars, so yeah, that, that's a lot. Uh, so let's see here. Okay, during a galactic civil war, rebel light spy steals Step Star plans. Princess Leia is captured. Droid R2, D2, and CP3PO escape and are sold to moisture farmers who reveal a message from Leia to Obi Wan. Luke joins everyone to save Leia and learns about the Jedi and his father. Leia's family is killed and they hire Han Solo and Chewbacca to meet Alderaan. The Death Star destroys Alderaan before they arrive and they infiltrate the station to rescue Leia. Obi-Wan sacrifices himself and the group escapes, revealing the Death Star weakness. Luke joins the rebellion and in a battle uses the Force to destroy the Death Star. Leia awards Luke and medals for their heroism. Okay, that seems really good to me. Uh, this is you know, obviously uh, very incredible. Um, and yeah, that's it. Incredibly, incredibly easy. So, thank you for watching this video in our Cortex series. And if you liked it, please do like and subscribe. And I very much look forward to seeing you in the next one. Thank you very much.